Yep. Hello. I'm Lula. And bonjour, everybody. This is Doug. And Matthew. From Crow Bros. Pipe. MB3. <laughs> and right now, you're looking at a leg workout we did. I'm back home for spring break, so we're at our local YMCA. Just because it's real close. Um, we'll be able to lift there all week together because I have uh, OGT week, so I get out of school early. Yep. So. High school testing for college is that, or for graduation. Yep. But I'm already, I'm already passed that. <laughs> <laughs> That's for fools. Uh, but anyway, only idiots don't pass that. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, so I'm finally back. You'll be seeing buying some gym footage. Um, of my 5x5. Five five. I know I couldn't show you any footage from school, so it's pretty boring. <laughs> but now you'll be able to actually see the lifts and see how I'm doing. And then... Yeah, you'll finally be able to see both of us kind of like training because we haven't had many gym videos at all because we don't have anybody to record really and it's just always crowded. But we got the Go GoPro camera that Matthew got from the yeah. channel. So. So we can kind of, it's really small, so you can kind of hide it, so you'll see lower angles, but that way it doesn't bring so much attention to us. Yeah, exactly. It's just, you can't really focus on lifting when you got everyone staring at you, like, why does this guy have a camera? What the heck is he doing? And you know, this also kind of shows how, no matter what your training style is or your goals are, you, get, you can still train with other people. Man, that house is really going. Yeah, but you can still train with other people. Like he's training for powerlifting. I'm doing more hypertrophy bodybuilding. Yet we're still everything's completely normal training together. Yeah, so. we still do every the same exercise, the same amount of sets. It's just different, maybe rep scheme and different yeah. weight, obviously. Yeah. But so we keep that identical. <laughs> and uh, the heck else? What do we talk about? Uh, oh yeah, you guys will see coming up pretty soon in a couple days anyway. Probably a few days till the video's up, but we'll do a posing comparison of off-season versus contest prep. Uh, yes, keep keep an eye out for that because, yeah, kind of a off-season bodybuilder versus a on-season bodybuilder. So that should be a good comparison to see what, how the difference is. <laughs> and then obviously, Posing update, Doug's getting closer to his competition. When's that coming up? Uh, it's about three weeks away right now on March 29th, and I'll be doing both bodybuilding and physique, so we'll see how that goes. We'll see which I do better at, if I do good at either of them, or yeah. I don't know, we'll see. At the least part, we'll have footage, at least pictures from it. Yeah, definitely. And uh, so, yeah, like three weeks from now. So Try to bring home another title for MB3. Yeah, MB3, bringing home the hardware, they call it. <laughs> Go for the yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know if the reason why I'm not competing this year is because I'm out of the team division, and so to go into the men's like open would be a huge step, especially in like the NPC where all they do is void up. Now that we know, like we were such cool, such like innocent kids, like you saw in their Mark Lobliner interview thing where we thought the first one we did in Nabo was natural, and he was joking, he said, the only thing natural that shows is peanut butter. Mm. So both of our shows, even MPC and now the teens, you hope you don't have to look out for that too much, but I'm sure it goes on in there too. Everyone wants to win and do whatever they can. But anyway, so that's why I'm not competing at least this year. I just want to try to catch up and hopefully do some, maybe a natural league or association, look that up. It's, I don't know much about that stuff. But <laughs> so, yeah, so Doug's doing that this year. He's still going to be a team, maybe not next year. Yeah, next year. Or next year, too, yeah. It really depends. I mean, I don't know if I want to do it again, but... Yeah, the same, Joe. Yeah. We'll see how it goes. I don't know, maybe next year, the Natural Northern USA, so I have over a year to oh, work yeah, like, for that, but... Because that would be the last one you could do as a team, right? Yeah, exactly. And But the thing is, is the whole thing about bodybuilding shows, is you have to do it for fun because it's so much money to buy all the food oh, and yeah. compete and everything and you really don't get a whole lot of, like there's no money in it obviously, like you're not yeah. going to win that. So. Absolutely no money and not only the money but it's so much effort okay. and oh my goodness. So anyway, basically you only do this if you're crazy. Yep, that's, that pretty much sums it up. Yeah. So. Hopefully you guys like the video. Speaking of that, you can actually like this video. Throw down a comment. And even subscribe. <laughs> but remember guys, there's always more on the way, so stay tuned. You can see this program starts on week one, 
with a certain weight and week two goes up, week three comes back down to what week one was. So it's kind of like a ego issue. I don't have to leave it back. But anyway.